Hello there, welcome to part three of my Invisalign diary. You had to excuse me, I've got a cold, but I suppose that's the interesting thing as to what these things are like when you've got a cold. <laughs> it's not very nice. Um, I mean, you when you take them out, you wash them and they feel all, all slippery and slidey and yeah, I can tell most people are probably logging off of this <laughs> this video now. Uh, but it's, it's okay, I'm near the end of the cold now and it, it's been fine, it's been no problem. Uh, so, so that's good. Um, I feel fine in myself, I just look coldy, because I am. But, uh, as you can see, see this little thing there? It's an attachment. So what I'm going to do now is going to go back to the video that I made when I got the attachments done a few weeks ago. Uh, over a month now, I think. What are we on now? This is the fifth one. Yeah, so I've had these attachments on for over a month. So let's go back and then I'll, I'll meet you back here. Today I got attachments on my teeth. Now, if you look closely, you can see there, you see it? And there's one further back. Also on this side, there's one. Yeah. And down there, there's one. And there. Uh, they've actually, they didn't put the ones, there's meant to be, uh, according to the trays, uh, one on the back of each incisor at the top. Um, so the trays have got a little ridge but the orthodontist decided that he didn't need to um, put them there, at least not yet. However, because all my trays are made in advance, um, he's um, there's nothing you can do about it. I'm just going to have to put up with it. And it was annoying for about 10 seconds <laughs> uh, to have these little ridges on the back of my teeth inside my mouth. But, but uh, no, it feels fine. So um, the other thing that he did today was to file down the edges and in between my teeth to make them narrower. Um, basically taking my teeth in at the sides, um, but they didn't do it all in one go. They're going to do it gradually uh, as I as I go back for more trays. Uh, they're going to um, gradually file them down a bit more to make room because my mouth is overcrowded. As I'm talking to you, there is a slight sharp bit on the bottom plate, which I'm probably going to take an emery board to because my second tray, I didn't have to do anything to it at all. It was fine. So it's obviously just occasionally there will be something like that. Uh, but no, I've not been sore at all. Uh, last tray, I mean I was sore with my teeth, you saw what, what it was like when I when you first have it done, so I'm guessing tomorrow is going to be tender um, because it's back to pushing on my teeth. But, no, it's good. People are bound to say, you've got something on your tooth, at which point I'll think, haha, very funny, and then I'll realise and I'll, I'll have to explain what, what I'm having done. Um, well, it's quite visible, but at the same time, from a distance, I don't know. I actually think it gives me character, but I've had enough of having teeth with character. That's why I'm having this done. So, um, yeah. Good thing is, though, um, I'm good now for, well, I've got 10 weeks worth of, of trays. See? 10 weeks worth. Uh, so I go back in the new year. So he said happy Christmas to me, which is quite, quite strange. Um... And so, yeah, that was the big thing. Today was the big one, having the attachments fitted. And now it's just just the same old, same old. Yeah, I think that's it. So as you can see, that uh, that was, I thought it was just going to be fine and normal. But then I tried taking them out. And it's actually really difficult to take them out when you've got these attachments on. Especially to start with when it's still pushing a lot on your teeth uh, because it's very painful. Um, and I had to work out ways to do it. And the way to do it is to unhitch it from the back, uh, just out towards your cheek, and then actually do it on the other side as well, out towards my cheek. So they're both out at the back, and then I pull down here, and I pull down there, and then the whole thing comes off on like, the second pull, just here. Uh, and the bottom ones are fine, but that's because these teeth are so, so pointing out, it really grips them, which is good. But as you can see, I think that's a lot straighter than it was even in the other video. It really is. So the front two teeth are looking way better already. I even think this one's come down. I'll have to do a comparison. And at the end, I will do some kind of uh, like time lapse thing. I'm sorry I sound so coldy. I'm fine. I'm all right. I'm OK. Uh, so um, what was I going to say? Yeah, the attachments are fine. It's, it's difficult when you're eating uh, to start with because you run your 
tongue over your teeth when you finished eating. And you think, oh, God, I've got loads of stuff on my teeth because there are these bits sticking out everywhere and it feels like you've got stuff stuck in your teeth, but it's not. It's the attachments they've put on your teeth. Uh, but it's fine. It was quite difficult to go to the office Christmas party because, uh, well, you know, you're trying to talk to people and, uh, and you know, you have to take these out when you eat. And then he brought out some desserts and I put them back in. And I don't like eating anything and then putting these back in without brushing my teeth because it, it doesn't seem right. You know, the dentist said you can do it, but I tried it and I don't know. I, you know, at one point I took them out and there was chocolate on the inside. I thought that's no good at all. So I'm, I'm not doing that very much at all. So basically still not snacking between meals. Uh, I did have a, the odd, uh, sort of biscuity thing at work or Christmas chocolate. Uh, but just near lunchtime so I could come home and do it. So, uh, I'll be back without a cold next time. And uh, until then, I wish you a very happy new year. Uh, thanks for watching and uh, hit like and subscribe if you like this. And do check out my other videos, please. That would be cool. Cheers. Take care.